So we've got fit in five with a dumbbell. So it's going to be a little bit tougher than necessarily body weight always is. Um, but if you've got dumbbells at home, then join in with this one. Cool. So five moves, five minutes, using one or two dumbbells. And we'll see you in a second. See you in a sec. another fit in five and today is your dumbbell workout me and Lucy are going to be using just one single dumbbell for the entire workout five moves 45 seconds on each with a 15 second rest between let's go move number one is your cross presses so you're going to have legs shoulder width apart dumbbell in your first arm you are reaching towards the opposite foot you drop down and touch keeping legs straight reach up and press so it's drop touch cross press Perfect, we're doing half work time. One side, and then we switch. Keeping those legs straight, fires into those hamstrings, squeezing the hips forward, fires into those glutes. Switch. switch over, other side, let's go. And press, good work. And press, perfect. And press, you're doing awesome guys. Push through it for me. Let's work into those legs and those arms on that second side. Last one. Good. And release. We're going into something called a clunge up. So it's a combination move of a curl, lunge and press. <laughs> We're going to have that single dumbbell. You start feet together. You're going to step back into your reverse lunge and as you do, you curl that dumbbell in for the biceps. Join feet together to press. And then you reset and just release that curl, starting from the beginning of a leg. You curl and lunge, press, and release. Let's clunge up. <laughs> I'm ready to clunge. Keep going. It's a combination move, which we love. <laughs> love a combo. Keep climbing. Love a cl combo. <laughs> it's a clunge combo. <laughs> <laughs> Last one guys. And relax. Good work. Alright. We are going into a front swing squat. So hold on to that single dumbbell in between the legs. You are going to sink low into your squat. Swing, drop and reset. 45 seconds like this. Pushing weight into the heels. Essentially, swinging that weight up in that squat position naturally pushes you into the exact position you need to be in to really fire into all those leg muscles and build that strength. Gets the little shoulder as <laughs> well. Keep going. Nice guys, come on. Keep going. You're doing awesome. We're nearly there. Push through. Guys, one more rep. Come on. And, and done. Good work. All right, we're going to go into an overhead tricep extension. Next, and then we're going to finish with a core move. So for this one, you're going to hold on to the top end of that dumbbell. Extend arms overhead. Then you're going to drop down behind you and extend. Let's go. 45 seconds is important to keep those elbows squeezing in towards your temples because if you let them flare out you're not getting that tricep work keep going guys good oh I'm feeling that burn me too good guys keep going we have only got Five seconds left. Last one. And done. Relax. Last move. We are going into a roll up, okay? So you're going to use that dumbbell for this final move as well to work that core. So what we want to do is we want to extend our legs towards one another. You're going to take that dumbbell straight up over the chest. And what I want you to do is try and keep your arms extended the whole time and lead from the chest up to the top and release back down. Let's go 45 seconds, guys. Push through that core. 
Nice work. Curling down through that spine. Holding on nice and tight to that dumbbell so it doesn't fall down. Yeah. <laughs> I'll knock you out. <laughs> yeah, no, don't do that. <laughs> Disclaimer. Hold your dumbbell tightly. Good. If you find you move in these, it is so normal. I always wiggle, like me and Rosie are getting further and further yeah, apart. Definitely. Last one. Yep. And relax. You've done five moves with a dumbbell that all together have targeted your total body. Yeah. Especially with those plunges. <laughs> we hope you enjoyed. Give us a thumbs up. Give us a thumbs up if you did. See you soon.